you alongside Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Welcome to EA Sports. The Bruins roll in as one of the hottest teams in hockey tonight, Ray. They haven't missed for a while. I've liked everything about them on this winning streak. They've took the game to their opponents. Their special teams have been good. Their goaltending's been good. When you're riding high, keep it rolling. Opening face-off is set to go. Referee Shil Levesque is ready to drop the puck. Well, the hype for this one has been off the hook. Puck is dropped. Let's see if this one actually lives up to it. The Blackhawks played along the boards. Saskatchewan's got a hold of it against the wall. That's just a great heads-up read at center ice. Moves it to Saad. Saad's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. And he sprints to the bench to get the extra attacker out on the ice. And let's see what the call is. Kapanen's been nabbed for tripping. Reaches in with his stick and gets nabbed for the trip. St. John's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. This has been a pretty tightly played game, but now they've earned the game's first power play. So they've got an opportunity to get the first strike on the board. Start with an offensive zone faceoff and a chance to get out in front. And that goes off a player. Dabrinkit swooping in on the attack. Shot denies him in front. The Bruins will kill off a few extra seconds now. Hammers it on net, and he comes up with the save. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. Is that essentially a pick on that interference? It is a little late to the play, and the official's right on it. A five-on-three with plenty of time to work with here coming up. That is quite some time on the five-on-three. What a big advantage for them. They have to take advantage of this opportunity. You can't let a two-man advantage slip away. And loses possession after a solid hit. Dumps it in. The Blackhawks gain control of it. Strong's got it into offensive territory. Shot denied by the goaltender. Make the save, help yourself out at the same time. Good stop, but the better part is that he gets the puck away from the front of the net. St. John's got control of it wow. now from their own end. Takes that pass back at the point. S Special teams coming up huge on that goal. They take advantage of having the extra man by moving the puck quickly. That's a beautiful goal. St. John's got that lead. They were talking about wanting to quiet that home crowd here. Well, they certainly did. Out of the gate quickly, a couple of shifts. Now they're up 1-0. Taken by Keith. Oh, big time use of physicality on that one. Yeah, this seems like it's going to be a tone tonight. The hit, the body contact, make sure it's a regular part of the game. A chance to clear, still under band. And now it's grabbed by Kane. Picks off the pass. Flips it at the net. Comes up with the stump. I think he got a blocker on that one. Carries it across the line. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. Takes the puck behind his own cage. Grabbed along the boards by Subban. And manages to clear the zone. Quick Whoa. pass to Kane. Passes on over to Kajula. Lowers the boom. Under siege, trying to get it out of their zone. That center takes the pass, and he slides it quickly to Keith. On the attack along the boards. Rister, big save. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. St. John's ready to go on the attack. Levels him with the hit. You can hear that hit from where I'm standing. He's not going to get up. He's going to need some help and attention from the trainer. Smith still trying to shake off the effects of this hit. He really took a thump there. Smith's not going to be able to go here. He's headed down the tunnel with a little bit of hitch in his giddy-up. That's some kind of leg injury. We'll try to get you an update as soon as possible on his status for the rest of the game. Taves has it in their own end. A strong penalty-killing performance on that one as both Whoa. teams are now back to even strength. Pass to Burns. 
Burns brings it in. Rips it. Denies him on the play. Puck picked up by Kadri. St. John's gained possession. And he's ridden off the puck. There's the whistle. Wow. Completely. They're going to go. Are they trying to send a message early here? Yeah, I think so. And it, it didn't look like it took much to drag either guy into the fight. Oh, and he hammers him and sends him down to the ice. That's a clear decision there. Uh, you can't touch momentum, but you can feel it. And the home team's going to build a little bit, they believe, after a fight win. Listen to this place. We're still in the early stages of this period. one nothing is where we sit at this point. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Let's it go! Big time save on a big time shot! Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And that one stopped. That's a good save. He had to struggle to find the puck to force the bodies in front of him. dropped and we are back underway. Carey's lugging the puck oh into the boy. middle of the neutral zone. Moves it around along the half wall. Dishes it to Carey. Makes his presence known on the ice. Here they are on the attack. Blocked in front. Puck scooped up by Kadri. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Moves along the blue line. From the blue line, they take control of it. On target! Picked up along the wall by Calvert. Unloads a shot! Misses wide of the net! This is why you have to be prepared for your chance. You don't know when it's going to come up. You get it, and you miss the net by that much. Hammers him into the boards! Puck carrier thought he could squeeze by. All of a sudden, the door closed. Over the line they come. Cannon of a shot! Too much traffic in the lane! He got knocked around somewhere on this shift. He's battling pretty hard to try and get the puck out of the zone. He needs some help from his teammates so he can get a change. Gustafson's not anywhere close to 100% as he finishes this shift. He was banged up during it, and he tried to make sure he got to the end of the shift. Still lots of time left in the period. 1-0 the score. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Steps into all of that. Saskatchewan's looking to break out of their own end. Brings the puck into the offense oh. again now. Puck grabbed by Strom. Moves it to Debrinkit. That's a solid hit. Hammers a shot. Oh, he stomps him with a glove. Great reflexes there. Saskatchewan's got the lead in shots. Nevertheless, they still trail here in the first. Back underway, and they take possession here. It's first. What a shot going far down. Centerman practice faceoffs at the end of every practice. This time, the defensive guy loses position. The puck ends up on the shooter's stick, and he rifles it by the goaltender. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. Feeds the puck to Seabrook. Right up the gut, here they go. And now he tries to get it across to Seabrook. Takes the feed. Moves the puck along the half wall. Nice defensive robbery with the stick. Feeds the puck up to Shaw. They've got numbers. 
The Blackhawks have a hold of it in the defensive zone. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Seabrook. And now he angles it across to Kane. Putting the hard hat on here. What a hit. Jenner's got it across the line. Shot from the point. Oh, what a stop. Great hit on the play. Slides the puck near the front of the net. It's in the back of the net. He scores! Quickly, two goals in right around 90 seconds. Conversely, deflating for the other team. Man, that is a kick in the shins right there. They just couldn't stop the bleeding. He drops into the butterfly to try and take away as much of the net as he can, but the shooter's got enough time to find some room. He sees it, and he doesn't miss. Saskatchewan's got a one-goal lead here in the first. What's the message on the bench, Ray? The message is to be aggressive, to get another one, to try and stretch a lead that you've just built. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. Rocks him. Thunderous hit. Oh, my. Yeah, that one hurt me over here. That is an enormous hit. He closed the gap in a hurry. He's slowly working his way to the bench. Somebody's got to get the door open for him. He's going to need some help. St. John's got the puck. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Saskatchewan's, look at this, pushing and shoving after the whistle. Yeah, it got heated up pretty quickly. And here we go, buckle up. Do it. Yeah, that's not going to go to the judges. You just don't see this much anymore. First of all, a fight. Secondly, that somebody's hurt at the end of it. Uh, hopefully, he's not hurt too badly. The Bruins have had multiple scoring opportunities here in this first and could easily have a much bigger lead. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. The Blackhawks gain possession along the wall. Takes it across the blue line. Uses the force on that hit. Slides it over to Kapanen. Here's a shot. Oh, he stopped that one. That was a fireball. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. It's 2-1. Taves quick on the draw. Moves the puck to Kane. Sod's carrying it ahead. Shoots it, and that one's turned away. Saskatchewan's had an amazing start. They've been on the body, they've got the lead, and they look like they're carrying the play. Saskatchewan still got time here in this first period to increase this lead. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And here's the pass to Kapanen. Hammers a shot and a great save. Taken along the wall by Byron. St. John's got the puck in their own end. Into the offensive zone. With authority again. James, I'm almost feeling sorry for him here. He's been throttled so many times tonight. Unleashes a cannon! Stops the rocket of a shot! And now it's over to Taves. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And forces a huge turn. Scores! We're all tied up! And now their bench has a little more belief as they've evened up the score. Oh, everybody's staring behind the net at the puck carrier. Hey, guys, turn around. The guy that's going to shoot it is standing right in front of the net that's in the cage. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. And now he moves it to Mata. There's a collision. Subban's got the puck in his own zone. Taken by Jenner. Here's a blast! Oh, I think he wants that one back. Didn't miss it by much. He gets lots on it, beats the goaltender, but just wide. Achari's got it along the wing. Wide! 
No, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. Blocker save, and he's showing up big time tonight. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Hammers a shot! What a stop as he puts out the fire! Looks to set up along the point. Hammers it on net! Blocked in traffic! Stopped by the goaltender. Here they come on the attack. Saskatchewan's got a hold of it along the wall. Now he takes it over the line. Unleashes a cannon! Denies him with a save! Past the midway mark of the frame, the next be a big one as we are tied. Great hit on the play. Oh, what a beautiful glove save! Carries the puck up through center. Fires it on net, comes up with a stop. Saskatchewan's got the puck along the boards. St. John's got the puck inside the defensive zone. And now he tries to get it across to DeHaan. Unleashes a cannon, makes the save, and put it out the fire in front. Taves plays it into Whoa. the offensive zone. Hey, James, big hit right over there. Just wide. And down he goes as the puck goes Whoa. free. Scores! And he puts his team in front. James, this game looked really comfortable as a tie game. Now they're ahead. They've got to continue to push. St. John's offense has given them a one-goal lead. Not to be Captain Obvious here, Ray, but this is what the coach wants to see, right? Love playing in front of the game, and you want to make the opponent chase you around the ice. They've accomplished that with the, with the go-ahead goal. Saskatchewan's down, but not out. They've had chances. They just haven't capitalized. Puck is dropped, and play resumes. Oh, set that hit up perfectly. The Blackhawks scoop it up along the boards. And now it's grabbed by Seabrook. Along the half wall with the puck. Solid hit on that play. Centering pass. Just can't complete that pass. Oh, he's got the right play in mind. He just doesn't execute the final pass. Lays the body. St. John's got the puck along the wall. Shot makes the save the pass from his goalie carries it in here's a blast that's blocked puck picked up by Kapanen makes the save what a reaction with the blocker there's the whistle as the puck goes out of play the Bruins have wanted to be a physical team and they're all over it tonight however when you're laying the body on that means you don't have the puck they don't have the puck enough but they're trailing Saskatchewan's down despite numerous scoring opportunities here late in the first. Puck scooped up by Tanev with authority. The Bruins have it against the wall. Puck grabbed by Kadri. They've got the defense outnumbered. With the blast! Big time stop there. Pretty efficient save there. The goalie helps the D-man out by putting the rebound in the corner. Here's a short pass to Kajula. Steps into it. That's three consecutive goals. Now the goalie keeps looking over to the coach saying, why am I still in here? Three straight for them. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the Blackhawks have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Taken by Dunn. By number seven, Brent Seabrook. Quick feed to Shaw. Drake Kajulia. And by number 13, with some momentum Whoa. driving towards the net. Uh, sorry about your toes, James, that I just jumped on. That was a huge hit. McCabe's going to play it against the half wall. Shuts him down. He reacts late, but he makes a save through traffic. And now it's grabbed by Strom. Puck sent over to Mata. A great read on the play. Saskatchewan's done a really nice job positionally tonight. They've stolen the puck every time, it seems, when they needed to. Carries it across the line, and a stick in the lane ends that threat. 
Moves the puck into the attacking area. St. John's gained possession along the boards. Gives it right back. And with the sound of the horn, that means the conclusion of period number one. Goals, goals, and more goals. 4-2 is where we sit after 20. Clean sheet of ice, period two is set to go. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two, puck is dropped, and we are underway. Denied by the goaltender. Takes the feed from his netminder. Slides it to Kapanen. Kapanen's got it against the boards. Hammers a shot, and that carries off a stick. Seabrook's moving it ahead. Mata's got it on the offensive end. Great defensive effort with the strip. Hammers it on net. Oh, comes up with a stop. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Saskatchewan's had the scoring opportunities. They just haven't been able to capitalize as they continue to trail. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Hammers one. Denies him. He got all of it. Saskatchewan's looking to convert on some of these chances. They've had plenty of opportunities, but have been snake bitten thus far. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. He'll keep it alive and moves it ahead. Seabrook's taking it from his own end. Oh, did he eat that hit? This is a good time to be retired. Takes the pass from his goaltender. Kadri swooping in on the attack. Rips it. Oh, absolutely owns the crease tonight. Save made by the goalie. Knocks the puck loose after a solid hit. A howitzer. He scores! Off the crossbar and in! The Bruins seem to have new life here as they get back to center. Pretty easy to tell from where I'm standing, James. The bench erupted when the goal went in the net. Now they're only down by one. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Rocked on the play. He got all of that one. Saskatchewan's got a hold of it against the wall. Shaw's got it into offensive territory. The Blackhawks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Nice save by the keeper to trap that puck to his chest. Scooped up along the wall by Myers. Myers looks around. Here's a shot. That goes wide. Let's it fly. Lays into the body. Picked up along the boards by DeHaan. With the 40 again. Again and again. How does he not notice? Get the puck. Move the puck. Get your head up. Passes right to the front. And they score. St. John's now made their way back to center ice for the faceoff. I see a lot of movement, a lot of talking on the bench right now. What's the message, Ray? Coaches are going up and down the bench, telling the players to stay on it. Try and get a third one. Don't back up. With possession along the wall. We got a delayed call coming up here as the referee raises his hand. And the official stops the play as somebody's off to the sin bin. Dunn's going off for two minutes here, boarding the call. I don't have too much problem with that penalty, James. To me, that's a pretty clear boarding penalty. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Standing tall with the save. Moves it quickly over to Strom. And he slides it quickly to Taze. And now he moves it quickly to Mata. The lane was plugged up, and that shot's blocked. He got all of that hit. Here's a shot with the stop. Directs it on over to Shaw. Over the line they come. Fires it! Too much congestion blocks the shot. And some good kick it away. Solid hit on that play. And here comes the pushback. Saab turning this challenge down. That's not part of his game. Denies him on the play. Works it across to Kajula. He's got a step. Ah, uh -huh, the save! He sold that move hard, but the goaltender stays right on top of him. Well, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. 
Interference the call. Can you argue this one? Well, you can argue anything, James, but that's fair. That's an interference penalty. Sajak won the faceoff. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Hammers the shot off the crossbar. What an offer right there. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. St. John's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Dubrink, it's got it in the offensive zone. He scores! Quickly, two goals in right around 90 seconds. I think we can officially call this one a route now. Yeah, this is a steamroll. This is old Bird. The Blackhawks have seen way more chances going on them, and yet they lead now by three. Really opportunistic evening for, for them tonight offensively. Not many shots, but a three-goal lead. Strom's got it across the line. Look at that right there. While he lowered the show at that place so cleanly, he was able to close up nowhere for him to go. Just a cinder block he ran into. Oh, what a stop! to get everything behind this hit. He really lays one on here. Saskatchewan's look good offensively to this point, but they continue to trail here in the second. Strom's won a big draw on their own end. Big hit. Rocked on the play. Completely misses a You don't even make the goalie work here. You've got to make him have to do something in the net. Sends it out right in front. Big hit. I can hear it from here. Yeah, that sounded like a car crash. What a huge hit. Here's the pass. There's the collision. Here's a chance right in front. Here's a shot. Oh, what a stop. They fight for it along the boards. Trying to end this siege. Grabbed along the boards by Debrinket. Gives them nothing in front. With the steal. Another stop by the goaltender. Moves it to DeHaan. Drives it to the front. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Takes it across the blue line. Quick shot and a great save. Picked up along the wall by Myers. Delayed penalty coming up here. Quick whistle stops the play. The officials seeing obstruction on this one. Interference the call. When they changed the standard a few years ago, James, I thought this was one of the best ones they did because it allows the game to flow along. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. And he says no! It's already, but you know he'd love to pull a hat trick out, see if he can get a third one. Is the third the easiest or the hardest? Oh, it's the hardest for sure. You, who knows if you're gonna get another, another chance in a game. Saskatchewan's got it now. Puck picked up by Perlini. Perlini's carrying it ahead. An opportunity for some power. He scores! Even under man, they deliver. That's yeah, a sloppy play by the power play. But shorthanded, they get aggressive, they get up the ice, and are able to score while down a man. St. John's brought it tonight. They absolutely have dominated here, especially with the goal scoring. A bit faster, they played with more skill, and they are filling the net. What a fun night to play in. Still lots of time left here in this frame. St. John's latest goal has now given them a four-goal lead. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And a nice job by the Killers on that one. Yeah, now they can get a change, get some fresh players on the ice. Here they come on the attack. Hammers it! Brilliant save! Read it perfectly! Tatar's got the puck. Unloads it! Comes up with a big loss save! The Bruins' depth has been tested this year, but you can see by their position in the standings that they have had outstanding performances up and down their lineup. Saskatchewan's been the busier team offensively with way more shots on goal, but they still trail in the second. Gets it out of his own end. The Bruins will play the puck from behind the net. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. 
Two goals in the bag already. He's got the puck again, showing some great tackers. Outstanding skill as he's got the puck. He won't give it up. Rips it on net. Big time stop. Saskatchewan's had a lot of good looks on net, but they continue to trail here in the second. Good job tangling up his opponent here. And manages to clear the zone. Slides the puck ahead to Byron. Hammers the shot, and he stands tall and goal. Oh. The Bruins gain control of the puck against the wall. Rocks him. On the attack along the boards. Now that thing sounded like a car crash when those two guys came together. He took the bad end of that hit. Now he needs some help at the bench. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Saskatchewan's look good offensively to this point, but they continue to trail here in the second. Nice start winning the draw here inside his zone. Makes the save! Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Gets it out of his own end. Well, the man advantage unit Whoa. might welcome being back at even strength after giving up a shorthanded goal in that power play. Tatar's got it in the defensive end. Here's a rocket of a shot. Makes the save on the slapper. Broken up at center. The Bruins get a hold of the puck along the boards. Hammers one at the net, just wide of the net. Quick pass to Mata. Oh, great read! Gets in front of it. Carries it in. Here's a short pass to Achari. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Puts it on net from the point, off a stick. Trying to clear. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. Sajax won the draw. Hard blast, way too high. He's at the point where he almost doesn't want the puck to come back. That's another miss for him tonight. Oh, look who it is again. Man, he's been on the receiving end of half a dozen times or so tonight. He's clearly part of the game plan tonight. I can't even imagine what the welts will look like after this one. Kane's got the puck along the wing. Quick feed to DeHaan. Drops the anchor. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Tries to get the puck over to Achari. Devastating hit on the play. James, sometimes you can hear the hit. That one, you felt it. Moves it around along the half wall. The Blackhawks will play it from the defensive zone. Dishes it to Carey. Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. He was waiting for him and laid the shoulder right into him. That might loosen a few of the choppers on that play. Is it across the line? Rocks him on the play. Into the offensive end now. Here's a shot, and that goes wide. Right out in front, deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Oh, he'll that one. There's the physical side. And we've got a two-on-one. Big time stop, gets a blocker on it. Slides the puck to Kadri. Pokes the puck away. Thunder is hit. Well, that's inevitable. He had his head down, got hit so hard he dropped his stick. Now he's got to go pick it up before he can join the play again. That's why coaches say keep your head up, right? Well, that's one of the reasons. He scores! Thomas Tatar! He doesn't waste any time getting this puck off his stick. The snapshot beats the goaltender from the high slot. Saskatchewan's got one here in the second. They need many more to follow, though. Yeah, but they've got to start somewhere, I guess. Something positive, something to build on, but it's been a pretty rotten game for them so far. By number 89, 
Tatar. Rocks him on the play. Saskatchewan's got the puck. Directed over to Tatar. Moves the puck along the half wall. And that's broken up. Along the wing up the neutral zone. There's a big hit against the boards. You want to squeeze by because you know the middle of the ice is the bad place. You go up the wall sometimes. The scores! That's just a minute between goals. We are not done yet here. Buckle up, don't even think about leaving your seat. Yeah, they got their track shoes on now. He doesn't miss too many, James. He leads his team in goals for a reason. The Bruins have got one late here in the second. What does this do for a team? Well, it gives you a little bit of hope, but man, they've been so far in the hole. This isn't enough hope to think you can really come back. Picked off in the open ice. There's the physical side. That's not going to fool him. Subban stick handling in his own zone. Here's a chance. Comes up with a stop. Duchesne's shot doesn't miss the mark very often. Very accurate, quick release. He's among the league leaders in goals this year. Getting into the later stages of this period, Saskatchewan's got to find a way to get a few more goals here as they still trail by a pair. And he makes the save. Quick shot, and that banks off a stick. Puck scooped up by Debrinkin. Absolutely wallops him. Big hit. He moved into the position to deliver the hit so quickly. Nowhere for the skater to go. Pokes it away in his own end. And it's a quick pass to Kane. Saad's got it in the offensive end. The Bruins gain possession along the wall. Up the neutral zone now. Rips it, denies him with the save. Whistle blown as the puck is directed out into the crowd and a souvenir for some lucky fan tonight. Saskatchewan's had a lot of good looks offensively, but they have run into one hot goaltender, which is why they trail late in this second. In front, the puck stopper gets on top, but we'll get a little stoppage in play here, Ray. Yep, goalies are going to jump on it as quick as they can anytime around the front of the net. Saskatchewan's had plenty of good looks offensively, but they have been snake bitten as they trail late in this second period. Pass across to Perlini. Intercepts the pass. With the blast. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Stopped by the goaltender. Feeds the puck over to Dabrinkit. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Burns is tripped up, and we've got a penalty coming up. Let's get the call here. Strobe's getting two for tripping. They're going to be down a man here. Once he gets his stick into the player's feet, it's almost inevitable a tripping penalty will result. Tough to argue that call. Another chance here on the man advantage. Every once in a while when you're on the power play, you fall asleep for just a moment, you give up a shorty. They're a real kick in the pants. They've done that tonight. Here's a chance to erase that shorthanded marker with another power play. Slides the puck across. Along the half wall with the puck. Snapper from the slot. And he easily stops that one. Has some nice footwork to free the puck up to his teammate. Pushes it across Whoa. to Achari. Achari's got it. Just wide. The Bruins scoop it up along the boards. Byron swooping in on the attack. Centering pass. Taken along the wall by Kadri. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. And manages to clear the zone. Throws one up to Byron. Unloads one. Too many bodies in the way. And the puck's not loose. Moves it quickly over to Subban. Scooped up along the wall by Duchesne. And the middle frame almost done. Scores! Putting the power in power play. Did just about everything right on that man advantage. They capitalized. Saskatchewan's got a chance to change the complexion of this game now with that one. Yeah, get one now. They're within one. Don't take a step back. Push forward. Look for the equalizer. Takes the feed from the left side. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Loose puck battle along the boards. And a heads-up kick pass over to his teammate. Over the line they come. Hammers the shot. Great glove save. Takes the feed from the goaltender. Slides the puck across to Saad. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. 
The Bruins have it against the wall. Centered out in front. Scores! Don't call it a comeback, but it sure is. He doesn't need too many chances to score. That's one of the reasons he leads his team in goals. He's got a great finish when he gets the opportunity. Saskatchewan's equalizer comes at a critical time of the game, late in the period, isn't it, Ray? Anytime you give up a goal late in the period, you feel like you've given up more than that. So this is a critical goal. Here's a blast! That'll do it to end period number two. This game's still up for grabs. And boy, talk about an offensive display tonight. And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. Third period, we are all tied up, and the next goal could be a biggie. He got all of that one. Yeah, and it was that guy who's picking himself and his stick up off the ice. Sends the pass over. Duchesne's got it into offensive territory, and he regains control of the puck. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Rocked Whoa. again. James, down here, it's pretty easy to see that this guy is being targeted. He's got to notice here. He's been hit so many times tonight. Hammers it on net. Turns it away on the slap shot. Each team is looking for an edge, and they have been doing it physically since the very first period. This has been a long night. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. We got a tie game. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Big hit. And he sends Whoa. it across to Kajula. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Takes a shot. And there's the save. The turnover. Here they come. Great reflexes. Another save. He was telling me this morning he worked on this in practice this week. Making sure the puck goes to the corner and doesn't stay in the net. Quick shot, makes the save. Oh, that's a good hit. St. John's got the puck along the boards. Handles it again. Saskatchewan's got the puck inside the defensive zone. St. John's got a hold of it along the wall. With possession along the wall. A little banging and crashing now. Oh, up like a car against the wall. What a hard hit that was. He had him close. This puts it just wide of the net. He didn't have much room. He's making the attempt for a perfect shot there. Knocked away. Good hit on the play. Oh, getting a little cheeky there. He's going to get the pushback. Well, he might not want to go here, but his teammate's going to jump in. And... Absolutely rocked down to the ice there. That was a heavy blow, and that is the end of this boat. And here comes referee Gilles to clean things up. Oh, it only takes one to stagger a player. In that fight, he looks like he struggled here at the end of it. He's not doing very well. Lots of time left in this period. It's all tied up. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Feeds it to Carey. Moves it to Strom. From the point, they take control of it. Puck grabbed by Jenner. zajax got it across the line. Big time stop there. The Blackhawks gain control of the puck against the wall. Now a quick pass to Perlini. On the attack along the boards. And oh, oh. thunderous hit. 
He thought he had all kinds of room. There was none. He thought he could get by him, but he got squeezed off. That was a big hit. Snaps one from the slot. Gets a stick on it to make the save. Big save by the goaltender once again. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. Trying to get it out of their own end. Gets it out of his own end. Rocked on the play. Did he ever get it, James? That's a really good hit. Now the player's got to go pick up his stick because that got knocked right out of his hand. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Quick pass to Kajula. To his teammate. Stones him in front. Kadri's moving the puck through his own zone. Quick shot. Shuts him down. Picked up along the boards by Jenner. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Hammers him with a big hit. Wow, he got right into him. Solid hit. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And they get it down. That good communication. They talk to each other. They're in the right spot. They just clear it down the ice. Here's a short pass to Carey. Stopped by the goaltender. Byron's picking up steam. Rips it from the blue line. Comes up with the glove save. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Perlini. Takes it across the blue line. Oh, rocks him like a hurricane. Hey, look out. Get your head up, man. Great glove save. Moves it around along the half wall. Taken by Kadri. And that shot dies in traffic. Moves the puck across to Strom. Boom! Man, sometimes you just can't get out of the way. But for him, it's been all night. He's been on the receiving end of these types of hits. And that clangs off the iron. Saskatchewan's still tied in this game, yet they've had no luck. Another post. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. Moves the puck. And he slides wow. it quickly to Kajula. Burns takes it across the line. He scores! Well, they break the tie here, James. This game had been hotly contested since it's been level. They now have found a way to jump into the lead. Saskatchewan's breathing a bit easier now here, coming up with a big goal in this third period. Their bench was pretty excited when that goal went into the net. Now they'll want to continue to be aggressive and don't let the opponent start to dictate the pace. And that goes wide. Puts it on net, and he comes up with it. He scores! All ruled no goal right away here. The ref has determined that this puck has been kicked in. They'll look at it again, but that's a call on the ice. is popular. The away team gets the goal disallowed after video review. Play set to resume and you can see they're still frustrated by that non-goal call. This neutral zone face-off set to go and we are back underway. Trying to clear and he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. Kane's going to play it against the half wall. The Bruins will kill off a few extra seconds now. Burns carries the puck in his own zone. Pinned up along the boards. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Back in in front and puts it wide of the cage. Man, it tells you how close it can be. If that's two inches to the other side, it's off the post and in. Great reactionary save on that chance. Saskatchewan's been the better team tonight. They have turned good defense into solid offense, and they lead here in the third. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Takes the feed. Moves it on over to Strom. Into the corner now. And instead of a whistle, it clears it away. And now it's grabbed by Myers. Pays it up from the back end. Oh, makes Whoa. the save. That was a rocket. And he slides it quickly to Strom. Laying the body. Let's it go. Comes up with the stop. Puck picked up by Myers. Slides the pass over to Calvert. 
Here's a blast! And he comes up with the big time save on that. Jostling for the puck and it's knocked away. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Rocked him in the open ice. Lays into the body on the play. That's a solid check on the play. The Bruins have possession ended. Tries to feed it over to Mata. Quick shot. Way too much. Congestion blocks that. Gets it out of his own end. Time running out on this power play. They've got one last chance here. Oh, Look man. Out. You better have your head up if you're going through that part of the ice. Off target. Saskatchewan's got the puck shorthanded and manages to clear the zone. That's probably not what they were planning on the power play. They serve up a shorthanded goal with the special teams unit, but now both teams back to even strength. Well, now they got a bigger hole to dig out of. They give up the shorthanded goal, a sloppy power play, and they pay for it. Icing is the call here, and those winded bodies are going to be out there for an extended period here now. Yeah, they can't get a change in, and so you go back and kind of meander your way back as long as you can to kill time and get a little breath. More than half the period left to play. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Jenner's carrying it ahead. Let's it rip! Makes a save! Cool and calm under pressure! Quick pass to Kane. Love that hit. The Bruins gain possession in their own end. Here's an odd man rush. Puts it on goal. Comes up with the stop. Grabbed along the boards by Jenner. Puck scooped up by Jenner. Just wide. Nobody's going to be able to block that unless they're way off target like his shot was. And he came up big on that last opportunity. You put this kind of pressure on, eventually they can't chase you anymore. Now he's got room to carry the puck. And makes the save. Past the halfway mark of this period. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Picked up along the wall by McCabe. Grips it and rips it! Oh, he'll want to have that one back! Wayne Gretzky says 100% of the shots you don't take don't go in. Same for the ones that miss the net. Here inside the offensive end, takes the feed from along the boards. Quick feed to Achari. Saskatchewan's looking to break out of their own end. Here's a rip! Oh, gets a glove on it to make the stop! Passes it over to Kajula. Tries Whoa. to give it over to Seabrook. The Bruins get a hold of the puck. Hammers a shot, puts it just wide. He's looking to put that just inside the post. Just misses. Slides the puck over. Lowers the boom with that hit. Rocked on the play. James, he is going to feel terrible tomorrow. He's been hit so many times tonight. Booming shot. What a save. He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Sends a pass over and makes the save. Look up to the video board and you'll see tonight's winning 50-50 draw number. Congratulations to the guy. Now, positionally, he's in the right spot here. That's a hard shot. He made it look rather easy. Shaw's absence will continue for the rest of the evening. He's just been ruled out by the training staff. Thanks, Ray. We'll see how this impacts the game now going forward. Aston Reese gains the zone. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Slides the puck across to Mata. Mata's got it against the boards. He got all of that one. Saskatchewan's got the puck along the wall. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. The Bruins have been focused on playing really physically. They've had the most hits this period. As a result, they have the lead. More than half the frame has been played here. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Here they come on the attack. Here's a blast, and that's broken up. Taken along the wall by Byron. Here's a shot. Oh, and he can thank his stick for that one. Yeah, it's in a spot. He makes a good save here. Puck grabbed by Byron. Oh, the glove save. Where'd that come from? Saskatchewan's attempt to put more pucks on net has paid off as they lead it in the third. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. 
scooped up along the wall by Achari. Scoops up the puck oh, here. Oh, man. I didn't see that coming. Sorry, James. Jumped in on you there, but that hit was huge as the play was just moving along. Moves it quickly over to Achari. Can't keep a hold of it. A chance to get it out of the defensive zone. We got a whistle, and they'll do it all over at the other end. Yeah, of course, the team that iced the puck isn't able to change players. A rule put in a couple of seasons ago. The Bruins have been the aggressor offensively tonight as they continue to lead in the third. Sajak's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. Picked up along the boards by Aston Reese. Answers the call with a big save. Rocked him. Lays into the body. From the point, looks to make something happen with the stop. He ran right through him on that hit. Lined him up, timed it perfectly. Just here in the late stages of this frame. Back underway and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Here's a, what a shot he scores! Oh man, the goalie thought he had this cover, James. You can tell from his body language, but it beats him, hits the post, and goes in. Now coaches talk about getting to the front of the net, make it difficult on the goalie, take his eyes away. Man, he only can see the player's butts in front of him. He can't even see the puck. A critical draw here. To break it's won the draw. Scored by number 38. Into the corner. We got a delayed penalty coming up here as the ref's hand goes up in the air. We got a minor penalty coming up here. For sure, on this one. James. I mean, this call was gonna be made. You could see the play develop, and now they're gonna have to serve two minutes. As we're about to drop the puck, more pressure on this critical kill here as the penalty killing unit goes back to work. It's been a lot of ugly moments on this power play tonight, James, but they've got another opportunity here. It's a critical time in the game. Sends it over. He scores! That's a short-handed marker. James, they took advantage of one little crease, and they were able to race up the ice, get themselves a short-handed marker here. Excellent puck movement on the odd man rush. They catch them short, and they make them pay. Saskatchewan's goal-scoring abilities have been on full display so far this evening and here in the third. Really impressive display. They've moved the puck well, skated, really forechecked. Well, there's really nothing they haven't done tonight. They fight for it along the boards. The Bruins get a hold of the puck along the boards. And now he angles it across to Kajula. He's got a step on a breakaway. And he misses. Oh, you don't get many chances like that. Not able to convert. Rips it, turns him away. St. John's got control of it now from their own end. Into the offensive zone. Oh, man, he got hit again. Man, he must feel like a pinata out there. He's been on his backside a half a dozen or more times tonight. Reads it perfectly in the defensive end. Gets it out of his own end. Now he slides it up to Carey. Nice pass. And now he moves Whoa. it quickly to Strom. Snaps it on net. Stopped by the blocker. Saskatchewan's got a chance to work the transition game now shorthanded. And manages to clear the zone. Looking to break out here on the power play. Fires it into the offensive zone. Grabbed along the board by McCabe. The Blackhawks Whoa. in possession along the wall. Pushes it across to Carey. Can't get it to go. St. John's been able to generate scoring chances through their work and skill. They're not able to finish enough of them. And that goes off a player in front. That's a solid check on the play. Feeds the puck to Strom. Strom's got it in the offensive zone. Moves it to Strom. He scores! Putting the special in special teams to...
Uh, the extra work they've done, the way that they've moved some people around has helped them cash in once on the power play. All right, we're going to get a goalie change here. I'd say the most important job for the backup goalie here is to take his time. Slow the game down so everybody can get a breath here late in this contest. St. John's still got to find two more goals, but they at least have one back. That gives them a little bit of hope, and the bench seems to have come alive a little bit. Taken by Giordano. By number 17. And a snap twig here on the shot attempt. St. John's gained possession along the boards. Carries it in. Wow, he got hit. James, there's nowhere to go sometimes. You know you're going to get it. You just have to take the hit. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. It's been a great night for him. He's got two goals already. But you know he'd love to pull a hat trick on him. See if he can get a third one. Is the third the or the hardest? Oh, it's the hardest for sure. You, who knows if you're going to get another another chance in a game. And that's blocked. Picked up along the wall by Duchesne. The Blackhawks scoop it up along the boards. Tremendous bone-crushing hit. That hurts here. You could hear it clean down on the ice. That was a solid, devastating hit. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. And now it's over to Burns. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. In the third period. Inside of the final minute here in the third. St. John's gained possession. Quick pass to Seabrook. Oh, what a oh. hit on the play. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. And the parade to the penalty box will continue as play is called for yet another penalty. Charging the call, you can really see this one coming a mile away. I thought he was going to let up on the hit to see how far he travels to make it, but he decided to finish it. Now he'll finish the next two minutes in the box. Here's a short pass to Seabrook. Breaks up the pass in the defensive zone. While they trail, he's trying to make something happen. Slides the puck down low. 